again. I've just got myself an all brass padlock. Absolutely gorgeous. I don't know who makes it and there's no key for it. That's all what's on there. 8465 8514 1976. So if anybody knows anything about it, please let me know. Now, I don't normally collect locks. I normally pick them and then move them on. But I've decided whenever I get an all brass one, I'm going to collect it. So I think I've got about six or seven up to now. So this is going towards my collection. So at some stage, I'm going to try to impression a key for it. I've never done it. So I'm going to have a go at doing that. So that may be a later video if I, uh, if I do actually manage to, to make one. But until then, the only way of opening it is to pick it open. So I picked it open earlier and it opened okay. So let's see what happens now. But as we all know, when the camera's rolling, things pan out slightly different. So. Beautiful lock to pick there. Not too complicated. And uh, there you go. And you get a lovely feel back on it. Absolutely gorgeous. So, yeah. If anybody knows anything about that lock, please leave a comment. And if anyone's got any advice and want to steer me in the right di direction on how to make a key for it, that'd be appreciated too. Because as I say, I've watched a few YouTube videos. And uh, yeah, and I want to make a key for it. So I also want to say thanks to Peter Lewis because his love for all brass padlocks sort of made me look at them in a different light and I thought, yeah, God, they are so nice. So, yeah, so down to him, I'm going to start saving them. So that's it for today. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Try a bit.